At the end of watching the video, a student would be able to design full header circuit using gates and to explain binary addition using full header concept and its circuit realization. The full header concept can be explained by two digit decimal sum example. If we add two decimal digit uh, decimal numbers of two digits, then if sum of any pair of two numbers is less than 10, no carry is obtained. While if the sum of the two pairs, pair is greater than or equal to base value, then a carry is obtained and that is shifted to higher place, MSB place for addition. And if no pair is left for addition, then result is placed at a higher bit position as shown in this example. Here the sum 7 plus 5 gets result 12 that is greater than 10. Then 2 is placed here as a result and 1 is shifted to next higher pair for addition. Adding the two numbers and the carry generated from previous stage again gets 12. Then 2 is placed at this position and since no further pair is left for addition, the carry is shifted to higher position. In the similar way, for binary numbers, if the numbers are such that in any pair no carry is generated, then result is shown as it is, while if a carry is generated during addition of any pair, the carry is shifted to higher position and if for addition and if no pair is left for addition, the carry is placed at a MSB position. Based on the example, full addition can be defined as addition of a pair of binary bits, assuming them as a part of large number that requires also adding carry of lower significant position. Thus, a full header circuit has three inputs, the numbers A and B and previous stage carry C and gives two output, sum and a carry C out. Based on the concept, truth table of full header circuit is shown here and the truth table consists of two outputs C out and S which depends on the input C, A and B. By using K map, the C out is simplified as AC plus BC plus AB while S is simplified as AX or BX or C. Based on the expression, the full header circuit can be realized by, zoom, by using an XOR gate of three inputs, A, B and C, and three AND gates and one OR gate. Furthermore, it can be realized, full header circuit can be realized using two half header and one OR gate. The sum A XOR B XOR C can be used to realize the circuit using two half headers where S at the first half header will be XOR of A and B and by further adding C in second half header with the sum of first half header the output of second half header will realize A X or B X or C. While the C out can be simplified using Boolean algebra and it can be obtained as this A C plus B C plus A B is equal to A X or B multiplied by C plus A B. That means the final carry output of full header can be obtained by adding carry output of second half header along with carry output of first half header. The references used in the video is Digital Logic and Computer Design by Maurice Mano of Pearson Education India and Digital Electronics by G.K. Karate, Oxford University Press India.